Okay. So. Here we go. The start of it, we start in World 5. The first level. This is like the scariest first level. And this is my first time seeing uh, what exactly my opponent did. Seems like we did a lot of the same stuff. Oh yeah, we opted to get that mushroom. Little chaotic though. I want to know how he made it through. We pretty much did like the same thing here. Look at this. Incredible. Not as fast as him though. Not as fast as him. That fish was like stuck in the ground. I don't even know what that fish was about. That's incredible. What's going on with my camera? Let me fix that. Get a little zoom in there so we don't have that weird cutoff. Thank you very much. All right, so for anyone wondering and on YouTube, this is best of five. So you actually have to win three matches. All right, we're both going to do the setup. We both have randomized colors going on right now. That's really good. Ooh, I opted to not take the damage for the speed strats. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that helps me out. And the good thing is, is a couple days has gone by. So I don't actually fully remember um, how these races went. I'm not exactly sure. But it seems like we're pretty synced. Uh, we both went for this pipe, which was the right pipe. Look at us. We're so synced right now. <laughs> we even turned left at the same time. That's hilarious. Both doing level 7. That's where I took my damage. I made sure I didn't get P-Speed there. That's very scary. He almost got P-Speed. If you got a P-Speed, it probably would have been very dangerous. Ah, yes. This is where I know how to get the P-Speed. Didn't really help me out that much. And I almost got a coin ship. Uh, this is a playback, yes. I'm, I'm doing this mainly for YouTube and stuff. Alright, so neither of us got the hammer, brother. He went back for it. I wonder what it is. Ooh, he took damage there. It's okay. I think I go for this fire. He got a star. Dude, I was so upset at that. Where did that fish even come from? Okay, I introduced a brand new strategy that not many people have seen here before. Where I drop, build my P-Speed drop, and then I build my P-Speed... And then I hit this donut right here, right up there. Gets rid of that level nice and fast. Although I didn't do it that fast. So watch Macobra's screen. You can see what I skipped with that P-Speed. I wasted a little time getting it, but I didn't have to go through all this. Look at all this. Oh, man. See why I did what I did there? Help me out a little bit. Although I can't say all that time is from that. He did fight the extra hammer, brother. So there's, um, there's a lot of that involved. <laughs> I didn't even grab it. It's so annoying. So right now, I don't even know if I'm in the lead, right? Because you can't see your opponent. Yeah, yeah McCobra definitely goes for this star <laughs> level 10 i'm pretty happy i'm pretty happy with the these level congrats sets again dude yo thank you very much for the congrats i really appreciate that who we got scanners what's going on man welcome back for two months dude with using that twitch prime thank you guys i'm gonna be less on the chat and a little bit more focusing on the commentary uh because this is for youtube what up youtubians I decided to go back for that hammer brother as a risk. And I think I ended up Yep. Yep. Dude. The worst. And then I, I was like, well, I died on him anyway, so I might as well go back. And then I got a different bro. I almost ran into him, dude. I was a little scared here. All that for a star. What a waste, man. I would have kept a good lead right here if I would have just not gone for it. Uh, this isn't last night runs. This is the rando finals. This was done a couple days ago. Okay. This isn't the tournament. This is the, the randos. But thank you. Yeah, the tournament is gonna is awesome. I'm waiting until people finish the first set of brackets before I start recording uh, for certain things. 
<laughs> oh, okay. So much going on. I gotta stop reading chat. I'm messing up. So I definitely lost the lead there because I suck. No, it's not your fault, Ed. It's not your fault. Dude, if I didn't go back for that stupid hammer, brother, I would never have been hit with that. <laughs> Dude, I'm so glad that um, I didn't have to worry about When I entered World 4 here, I'm all... Because you can't see the first tile. And when I saw level 1, I knew that I didn't have to worry about... Ooh, Macobra wasting a little bit of time there with the uh, confusion. Should I go for the star? Should I not go for the star? Do you see that star? You see it bounce back? It like hit the corner of the block. That is so weird. Uh, we're both going to take the chance here. Will it pay off? I love P-Speed in this level. I wish this level wasn't an auto-scroller. I wonder if the creators of Nintendo were thinking, eh, you just did a minute and a half auto-scroller. Give him a break. Dude, these fast seeds. These fast seeds. The boat level is really fun when it's not an auto-scroller. Really, really fun. Okay. This level is obviously better as an honest scroller. Luckily, I kept, um, I did like kind of like a single frame jump. I don't think it needed to be single frame, but it was very close, which uh, allowed me to keep my P speed. If not, I would have lost even more time. Ooh, we both got the same outcome, man. We both went right through. That's so annoying. You know what's good about this and watching the playback? Fast forwarding. Right on. <laughs> I love these playbacks with the fast forward. So this is actually a pretty dope World 7 to see. Um, mainly because there's nowhere else to go. When the path is linear, you know you can't lose to like gambles and stuff. Dude, that troll fireball from that plant. Alright. Kind of easy to do this level when you don't have random Paragoombas. I still got hit there! That is incredible! How did I still get hit there? Well, I did. Go me. Alright, so World 7 is like a big route divergence. Let's see how this goes. So I think we both hit that pipe. Yep. So if I would have... It's crazy, man. It's crazy how long the pipe transitions take. Because he had a, he had such a big lead. But, it, like, let's pretend I didn't check this pipe, right? Okay. So I think we're still checking the same pipes here. Yep. Except I got a leaf, not a star. I'm very excited for Macobras and Zikubi's match tonight with uh, the point system tournament. Oh, I hate this fortress so much in randomizer. It's because this, okay, so this fortress was designed to be at the end of the game when you're like juiced up on power ups and like mushroom houses. This game wasn't designed, or this level wasn't designed to like small Mario, you know, I don't know. And then with random enemies. This level would be much easier, Small Mario, when it's not all the fire plants. It's crazy. I caught up a nice chunk here by being able to use P-Speed strategies. Double base, did you see the message I sent you in Discord about your uh, world layout and how it soft locks? All right, so we did the fortress, and now it's just check random pipes. And I found a good pipe here. I decided to go back, or no, Macobra went back. And I went in, and I went back, and I was like, I don't know. And it looks like we need to find the other fortress. Oh, so Macobra's going in the pipe that I just went into. But I'd already gone in that pipe, so I know that I can go in at least that pipe right there. Yes. 
So that does not give me any advantage. So now I gotta go all the way back. Okay, luckily... That's right, I didn't get lost. I was scared there. I thought maybe I would've got lost. But I cannot catch up yet. Excuse me. Damn. Damn, he had he had a tail here. I remember when I was when I was doing this first race that when I entered Four Knox with the tail, I was like, oh man, I might have a huge advantage here. But um I never did. Turns out. I didn't have advantage at all. So we both know how to get through this world, which is good. Ooh, McCover taking the wrong pipe. Do I also take the wrong pipe too? Do I get confused? Look how much I catch up just from those pipe transitions. It's incredible, man. I can't, I can't handle how, like, look at how much I caught up. Dude, I'm right behind him now. I definitely checked for a music box. So I was like, get me the heck out of there. Ooh, that damage is gonna hurt me later. Alright, we got a P-Wing. Not the exact item you want to see. Not. But, might be able to do this level a little bit faster, I'm not sure, because of, because of Big Mario. It depends, all depends on what the item is. What do we get? Fireflower is pretty good, man. And I was able to, yeah, definitely secure a little, oh my god, I clipped in the pipe, little, what the heck was that? I like flubbed off of him. Yes, there's a points tournament match uh, live tonight, yes. Hosted by yours truly. Alright. So I'm not too far behind. Luckily, we're synced up in the airship because that means fast forwarding. Alright. Dude, I love the fast forward. We just saved like 10 seconds. Alright, world three, here we go. Oh my gosh, the, the mini chungus bros. Oh my gosh! Dude, some of my dodges there were incredible. Never seen that. Ooh, a star, that's good. Got a oh my god, I got stuck in the ledge too. This whole time I was like, would you stop video game, please? Realizes he has double hammers. I just noticed I had double hammers too. So I was like, I should die. I should definitely die right here. I didn't have to fight the Hammer Brothers, so we are absolutely synced. Oh my god, I got screwed over here. So, get, look look what happens. I was like, okay, let's fight the Hammer Brother. And then we can go back and see what it is. Maybe it was a cloud or something. And I'm stuck on the in between the bridges, so I have to do this level. Oh, that was so frustrating. I remember that exactly. You hate to see it, guys. The absolute worst thing to happen. It was, honestly, it was such a noob move, too, because I crossed the bridge, so I knew that the bridge was going to be closed, but when you're playing randomizer, sometimes you're not thinking properly. It's, it's really weird. Alright, so Macobra has found the pipe there. And now it's my turn. So I actually have done one extra level so far in this world, which sucks. I do a turn back there because I don't want that shell to come back and bop me right in the nose. I stomped the first shell and I was like, I'm not going to be able to grab that on the hill like that. Like, there's no way I was going to grab that shell and it was going to kill the other shell and it would have just been a nightmare. So I just gave up on the shell on the hill. I gave up. There's no way. There's no way I could do it. If I fight the hammer, brother. 
Back on track. He was getting ricked there. He got the hammer, the same one that I got too. And we found the pipe. There's a lock up there, but I didn't see that lock. So I go and do that, this fortress. So if I would have gambled, um, with a fort, Macobra's movement there is just so, it's just so wrong. Right? Like, that, like, I don't know anyone who would do that. He, he's go, instead of going to the fortress right at the beginning of the level, he's deciding to do an extra level and a fortress for a huge gamble. I double check, I saw the lock. So I didn't see the lock on the mini island. So, because I had not noticed the lock on the mini island, you know, and then of course I go for the most... But this fort is just way too long. Look at how long this is. So, we're both we're both taking, I guess, a gamble. Mine's not really much of a gamble because it's the closest fortress to me. Whereas he's taking a gamble, and you guys will find out which one pays off. The, his gamble... Macobra's gamble is so scary, man. I, I wouldn't have done a gamble like that. Especially since there was an extra level in front of it. And me, I already accidentally did an extra level. Which is really annoying. Which is really, really annoying. So he sees that lock not breaking, so he knows that he did the right fortress, and I, am um, unfortunately, am doing the wrong fortress. So I lost that gamble. So I had to do two extra levels in this world. Hate to see it, guys. And I died at the start of the world, too, because I saw the double hammer, and it's, um... I'm not doing too good right now. So I know I need to take the pipe, but I could have saved the pipe transition if I just moved on the map, because I already did the level. Noob moves, man. I'm super tilted right now in this world. I know I'm tilted. I feel it. Felt it the whole time. But, I can rush, right? Speed strats. Speed strats and gambles! Come on! I'm on the one-way ticket to a, uh, coin ship. Macabre, that's already the drinking game right now. Oh my god. For some reason, World 3 Fort 1 is just so weird in terms of peace speed strategies. All right. So it looks like I'm behind by a good chunk here. Hey, we got the upside down orb though. Wee! Oh, the double snipe from Macobra, that was sick. I finally realized, you know, don't do the pipe transition, Mitch, you're a dumb dumb. Um, but I think I'm back on track. I think I'm feeling good now. I can uh, get myself on the go. I only have a fire flower in my inventory in terms of power-ups. And trust me, you do not want to use that power-up. Because that is... If you don't get a power-up like a hammer suit, then fire flower is the only thing you have on Bowser. And that is a easy 40 second time save. So... Yeah, well, I mean, I started to say it a lot last night because it was, you know... It was starting to turn into a meme. It was fun. All right. So we are not synced in the airship, so I'm not going to fast forward. Macobra has almost a three-level lead on. He's going to have a three-level lead on me. Maybe even more by the time... Ooh, ooh, he's fumbling. I should get a custom license plate. It's U8 to see it. <laughs> All right, so I checked the item. I'm I made it into world. So he is officially three levels ahead of me All 
No fire flower for Mitch, so... I'm gonna have to, uh... I'm scared here. Look at this. What is that enemy? It's like a beetle collision, and I messed up that, and... Oh my gosh, I messed... I'm... S I'm yelling right now in my office. Look at how many frames this is going. Dude, that's like six frames a second. That's unheard of. And I gotta take it slow, too, because I took damage. If I didn't take damage, I would have just kept going. I would have said, you know what, frigate. I would have just said frit it. All right. This is a lost level is what they called. So within the game's code, there's like, I don't know, like 19 or 18 uh, levels that have designs and stuff, but they didn't actually put them in it, the official game. Um, so. Last night when I was eating my Caesar salad, I got a piece of crouton stuck in the center of my back tooth. And when I went to bite down, the, the crumb that was stuck in the tooth scraped the side of my cheeks. So now I have a cut on the back up part of the inside of my cheek. Worst feeling right now. Friggin' croutons, man. Oh, he clipped! Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that is an MFPO. Sad times. All right, suddenly it feels like I'm not three levels behind, right? But I am. Or at least I, I think so. <laughs> yeah, Forest Kitty, what the heck? You gotta cut up my croutons for me. I'm a baby goo goo. Bam Bam needs crew crews. Ew, not pre chewed croutons. So, I don't think there's any real purpose to uh, finish this uh, fortress with the lock because it won't actually be in the path what Makobra's doing. I've often wondered if you use a star here, if you can get that clip and get the item. That would be crazy, but it is possible, I'm pretty sure. It, if you have a star, you can clip in that section. And I don't know if it's a soft lock or if it'll clip you to the room with the item, but... I definitely want to try it. Making a gamble here for this hammer brother. Getting screwed over, not surprised. Ah, nice P-Wing, what a waste. If it was a cloud, it would have been much better for me. So I have no idea if, uh, if I'm ahead or behind. I'm guessing I'm behind. Uh, mainly because of that World 3. Yo, Teeks, welcome back, baby. Thank you very much, dude. Are you excited for uh, Zikabee's and uh, Makobra's match tonight? It's gonna be crazy. With the uh, point system tournament. Okay, so the way the World 1 is set up, um, even if I wanted to skip a fortress to try and save time on Makobra, I actually can. It's a little too linear. It's a little too linear. You have to do all the, all the levels and all the fortresses within that path. Yeah, not clutching out that off-screen wand grab. Very unfortunate. Really wanted to nail it. Right. Well, I have a tail, so that's good. Uh, I will be able to save a little bit of time in this fortress because no locks or anything's really blocking my path. Unfortunately, I got a mushroom. Makes Mitch a sad sad. Not the lock, so I, I'm doing the same levels as he did. Oh, he got sniped though. Dude, I take chill strats here. I was wondering, should I take the pipe? I should have actually tried to jump over and land on the top blue section and build my P-Speed again. But I've never actually tried to make the jump without a P-Wing 
from the pipe all the way to the top blue section. I wasn't sure if I could actually even make it. Nope, that is an unbreakable brick in World 1. You cannot break that brick. There are three kind of, uh, there's three kind of boulders in Mario Brothers 3. There's only three kinds. There's, uh, breakable horizontal, which means when you break it, it creates a horizontal path. Breakable vertical, which means when you break it, it creates a vertical path. And unbreakable. Bacon, 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 big fork, bacon, big bite. Oh, try to get the orb? I got it. Nice little time save there. So I still have a good chunk of catching up to do. All right, I got one level. I, I was three levels behind, but we're going to find out kind of how many levels behind I am right now. I'm not too entirely... I'm not too sure here. Let's see. We's oh, I took damage too. I don't get the hit here. Dude, we took damage in the same place. Uh, and I'm shitting bricks right now? Okay, I'm safe. Oh my gosh. Ooh, Makobra with the 99 coins. If there's already a coin ship, it's not gonna do anything. No star, but I opt to use the leaf here. Pretty good. Nice. I should have tail swiped in case he did jump. Did like a combo. Um, and I'm not sure if Makobra got that star. Or that cloud. He did get the cloud, okay. Two Lakitus in level there's there is there's naturally two Lakitus in level four. The Lakitus we saw in level four, those are always there. Oh! Did, did Macobra die? Damn! Giving me time. So now I'm actually kind of not uh, three levels behind. I'm kind of catching up a little bit here, so... Those of you at home watching on YouTube, you do not know how this race turns out. Don't cheat! Don't look at the length of the video, that's cheating! You're supposed to... You're supposed to click on YouTube, go to my channel, click on this video blindfolded so you don't get spoiled. All right, Cobra clearing that up. Looking pretty good here. I got a hammer suit, I see that. Nice, he's the old cloud. So, Cobra has not used his cloud. I opted to use my cloud. I have an extra hammer. Screw it, I'm out. Hammer Brother battle. Cobra skipped this Hammer Brother battle and it was a music box, so it was a good skip. Yeah, I wish I could just make a fake timing. <laughs> oh, this is interesting. Does Macobra get screwed over with the, uh... Got a star here. Does he get the coin ship? It's funny because at this point, I mean, it's... We still got World 8. Nice, be level 9. Get out of here, boss bass. Nobody wants to deal with your crap, okay? The chungus bass. Get out of here. Nobody even likes you. Let's see if Macobra does my uh, swaggy slide strat at the end on the second donut. The skip falling with the donut. It all depends on this enemy. This enemy can... Yeah, slide. No! You guys will see what I do here. You guys will see. Oh, don't you... Unless I lose my tail. You'll see what I do. I got the strats. I am slowly gaining time here, guys. Because I don't have to fight that coin ship. Got the hammer. 
And Macobra's out, man. He's out of World 6 right now. Like a boss. Are you guys ready for my super awesome time-saving swag strats right here? Check this out. Boom! Get out of here. I am not waiting for no donut block. I've had enough of those donut blocks. Don't do that if you don't have the tail. Or wait. Do it if you have the tail. It'll work. If you don't have the tail, it'll work even better. Alright. So I see a level 10 there. I already saw like uh I already saw lock and there's one fortress, so pretty good. Looks pretty good. Can't really complain here. Looking pretty hot if you ask me. Pretty sexy. Guys, hamburgers and french fries for dinner. I'm so excited. They should be done in like 20 minutes. What's going on, still fly? What's going on, Kryptonite? Viva, how you doing? Jess, uh, GSR? What's going on, my dudes? How's everyone doing today? Macobra's small Mario, very scary. No world record attempts. Don't worry, I'll get to the world record attempts. Very busy month this month, guys. I got my point system tournament, the randomizer, uh, the finals we had. Um, we got Super Rift Bros. I had to resubmit stuff to GDQ. Uh, been doing uh, some commentary for the points tournament and setting it all up. Doing a little bit of commentary for the Haxer. I got more commentary for him coming up on Saturday. Very busy month uh, for Mitch Flower Power here. So I'm going to try my best to do as much as I can. I'm going to try and squeeze in uh, some Rift Bros at the end of... Uh, tonight's uh, point system match so I promise I'm gonna try and keep doing attempts on top of everything okay Macobra getting pulled into that the worst hand the worst hand trying to die but he can't do it all right so you love to see this in world eight because you got two hands and then you just go in the pipe got that cloud okay I'm going in this pipe Oh my god, Macobra is right at the end there. Using his Fire Flower. Dude, he should have went for Jesus Clip. It would have worked, I swear. Where am I going? Oh, I didn't get pulled in by the hand! I'm thinking to myself, where the heck do I go? And then I'm like, oh wait, no, I got to cross level 2 here. Yeah, use the Hammer Suit, Mitch. Alright, luckily this level isn't too bad. Luckily it's not too bad. If Macobra's Fortress breaks the lock, he is good to go right now. And he's pretty far ahead of me right now. Oh, it does not break the bridge. So he cannot cross. He's got to go back. He's got to go back. Oh, we got a Fortress right here. Beep, beep, beep. Hey, bam. I also go into the pipe. And we see the fortress as well. So I have to do the fortress. So this is good for me. So on Macobra's position, he should go back and check the pipe every single fortress he does. He also didn't see a lock break. Oh, not the right fortress for Macobies. Not going to work. Go back, buddy. Where's he going? He's going to take that pipe. All right. He knows the other tank is not the fortress because he's already done one tank. That was the fortress. Oh, man. If only that broke. If only that made the bridge for me and not for him. That would have been awesome. I would have had a great time. I already have that fear that I'm behind right now. So I'm very... I'm very like, ooh, man. If this is the fortress, I might actually have the lead here because I... I can see in speedruns live that he has not finished his race yet. He has also seen that I haven't finished yet. Um, so we can see here. Are you okay there, Mario music? That was strange. Oh, Macobra builds the bridge and he's using his hammer suit. So we know the fortress that I'm in right now is the fortress to the end. It is the fortress to the end. So I gotta hope. 
I gotta hope that he dies here or something. Come on, man. Even though I already know the outcome, still gotta hype it up. Oh, I know it happens, all right. Oh yeah, that's right. The Cobra is going for the clip. How many times does it take? You gotta press duck to get that clip. Got it, you need peace speed. He's flubbing it. I'm catching up. Those duck inputs are not helping. Holy crap, I'm coming. I'm a Bowser castle away. Holy crap, not hitting that. Oh, and there it is. I I do not see him dying on Bowser at this point. I don't, there's no way. Yo, JM Barry 789, 20 months, dude. Welcome back. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. I lost. That's it. I lost game one. Probably gonna lose game two and three too. Frig. My stupid world three routing, man. That's what got me killed. I was all over the place. Double hammer, like, kind of actually worked for us if you made crazy gambles, but I did not make any crazy gambles. All right, well, being as this is YouTube and I can fast forward and I'm doing commentary, guess what? We can actually just go We can just fast forward through all this crap we do not have to wait any longer for the setup. Uh, but if you hold on one second. All right. Here we go. Do the fast forward. The match is going. All right, game two. So, uh, I did not notice that they started the race. So go Mitch! Yay! Like, I pressed dot ready and I opened up another window. I pre I typed dot ready, I opened another window to do something. Because normally they kind of like let you know what's going on and then I didn't even notice, so... Guys, I'm, I'm instantly behind by 30 seconds. I'm in- uh, there you go, 30 second- I gave him a 30 second head start. You're welcome. And then I died. I am not having a good time. Double check and pipe. Oh no, I did a screen transition there to skip them. That's right. Smart plays, guys. At least I did the smart plays. Right? Did you guys notice that? I went over so I could skip them. Yeah. Yeah, I never dot ready when you're not ready, guys. You know, normally they at least give you some kind of like, okay, you guys are ready. All right, let's go. Oh my God, they're syncing me up right now. I think they're syncing me up, but they don't need to. Oh, it's synced. It's synced all right. I'm not sure why they delayed me that much. I was already delayed. If they were gonna sink it, they did it the wrong way. Yeah, that's funny. Okay, now they're sinking Macobra. They were synced up originally. There, there was no desync there. I, I legitimately started late. So they must have thought that there was some kind of delay, but there was definitely no kind of delay. And like now they're hardcore syncing it up. I think they're gonna wait until I'm at 142. Gosh dang it, they should have definitely- they- they didn't ask, I don't think, uh, in that little chat there. You know what, they stopped my video and then they stopped his, so I think, um... I think there's no desync here now. I think there's no desync. So I think we're good. Alright, so we're good, we're good. There's no desync. So I'm off to a fantastic start, you guys. Yay! 30 second time loss. Woo! If I was just ready when I said I was ready. Yo, that the Did you guys see that? The statue strats in that level. I would never have thought to use the statue. I'm not even kidding you. I never would have used it. 
You probably tried to statue. But, lucky for me, I have the hammer. So I just took the lead. All right, dude. I'm not doing that piece of crap level. Look at the level he just did. It took him like two minutes. No, it took him like 50 seconds, but still. Naturally, that level is already like 30-something odd seconds, but that's when the game is running at 60 FPS. And in Randomizer, that game never runs at 60 FPS, so... I don't know, does Macobra have the hammer and, and chose not to use it? Is that what happened there? I didn't actually see him get the hammer. Regardless, I, uh, I took the lead with that and I am out of here. No, I'm very far from world record pace right now. I wonder what the fastest seed has been in this, uh, this tournament setting. Oh god, this boss. You do not want to do this to small Mario. He goes to fight the hammer- okay, so which one is this one? What's going on? They're pausing both of ours? Is that what's happening? Is that what they do here? Oh, I didn't get to see what item it was! I missed it! Damn it! Why didn't they just ask me in the chat? Why, would, why didn't they just say, Hey Mitch, did you start late? And I would have typed yes on this cutscene, you know? I would have been like, yeah, I started like 20 seconds late. Oh, taking damage. Dude, this boss. Not having a good time. Looked like he wanted to go for a little off-screen wand grab there, but not gonna happen. Oh, pulling in the speedrun strats, guys. Didn't keep P-speed, though. It's very unfortunate. There's something weird about randomizer in certain places. Yeah, I was too busy looking at the bikini babes. I didn't get a chance to start right on time. I always dot ready and go right to the bikini babes. Gives me good luck. Whoa, music box! Twisty castle, let's go. So I was nervous about that music box usage because... Ooh, I almost took the damage. Uh, because I thought to myself, if my opponent does those Hammer Brothers and gets clouds and stuff... Um... It depends. If he gets a cloud and fights both of them, he really didn't save that much time. Odds are, because he's gonna hold on to it, probably find the level of the cloud, then die. The cloud's gonna save him five seconds, so... If you have a choice between skipping two Hammer Brothers or fighting them both and getting one cloud, you know your opponent's gonna die in a level, then use the cloud. So that cloud is really gonna save them like five seconds. It's not gonna help them at all. So you should always music box a double Hammer Brothers situation. You should always music box. We took the pipe right there and it leads me right to the end. You love to see it. So he's gonna fight it. Let's see what item he gets. And I was worried about him fighting. So let's see what he gets here. Nope. You already got a music box. Don't need another one. Is he gonna fight the other hand? Nope. He's out of there. He probably thought to himself, you know what, I already fought one. But he gets the damage boost here. Does he take it? No. Holy crap. Uh, Twisty Castle with tail and no P-speed is very slow. I don't know. I think he was trying to do a duck jump. Yeah, just like that. I think he was trying to do that same thing, but... Eh. You can't get it all the time. No clip clip. On the airship, flip my butt on the airship now. Dude, oh my gosh, Macobra almost died two times there. He almost fell off and he almost got hit by the Koopa. That was very scary. Latest single, yep. <laughs> So I got a nice lead right now. This is really good. Uh, choosing to use that hammer. I know Macobra still has his hammer. So I need to get a hammer here so that um, him holding on to his hammer for World 4 was a waste. Um, but I, as we saw, I don't know if he got a hammer in the last Hammer Brother or early Hammer Brother. So I'm not sure here. So World 2. Take the pipe. So let's see here. Um, 
So this is very confusing. I'm I'm double blocked here. So I thought that I could gain an advantage um, because I could have done level one and the pyramid and then that um, uh, that fortress. But I, I decided to go back in the pipe and do the, the closest fortress, right? I mean, I'm not really gambling here, but at the same time, it kind of is a gamble. Just because in logic, doing the closest and the first fort closest to you is the most likely outcome doesn't mean that it's always going to be the uh, the right right thing. So that didn't break that lock, and that made me very happy because I was like, oh, if this just breaks that lock, then I, I should have just went back and done the other two levels first. All right, so we got a lock break, and we are clean and good to go here. So thank God that, you know, odds are that that fortress was going to break one of the locks in my pathway. Um, but it was it was very possible for it to break the lock in front of the other fortress. So I say I got pretty lucky there. Come on, what are these guys doing? They keep pausing it. Stop. There's like, they keep trying to sink it so that it's like a close race or something. Like, just leave it. The SRL time will tell you the, the race results. Right? The commentaries keep like pausing and starting it to try and make it perfectly synced for a more accurate race. But like, just leave it. It's fine. <laughs> They're doing their best though. They're doing their best. So I just got a cloud. Always combo the clouds, right? Why get inventory items to, to hold it? I've watched people lose in this tournament because for some reason they decided to not use their items. They, the, the, the thought in the back of their head, well, in case I need it, but like, you need it now. Use your items now. There's no reason not to, right? So uh, here we go. There are lots of opportunities where you should hold on to your items, but at the same time, like the races are way over, they're over way faster than, you know, than you think. They're always, they're only, they're very fast. If McCobra doesn't use his cloud here, I'm very interested to see what the pyramid is. Most likely I'm not clouding. Um, I'm not clouding a long level, but what I will say, okay. Yeah, so I clouded the, like, this is the most perfect level to cloud. Um, not only is this a really long level, but when you just straight up use clouds, you don't actually enter a level and then die, lose your power up, then have to get your power up in the next level and then use your cloud, right? So if you cloud a 25 second level, but you enter that level, die, lose all your power ups, then cloud it, then go slow in the next level to get your power ups, that cloud is really only saving you like five to 10 seconds. Uh, yeah, I noticed the bro was in the wrong spot for you. Yeah, that's why I didn't say anything. You couldn't get the cloud even if you wanted to. You didn't have a choice. I yeah, know. All right. So McCobra getting the cloud now. So he still has the cloud. So if we're, if we're forced to do Atlantis, that there's no way that that cloud wouldn't save time. But that seems to be the only case here. That cloud will not save him uh, a usage in 5-9. Because what will happen is he'll enter 5-9, he'll die, use, use the cloud. And the cloud will only save him 25 to 30 seconds. Whereas that level he did that I skipped, I saved way more than 30 seconds. But it was a gamble I took, right? I just used the cloud whenever I did. But we'll see how it goes here. Uh, I'm not sure how far or ahead I am. Well, oh, we'll see in a second here. And again, he still has his cloud. So if he just randomly uses his cloud, that'll be a big time save. I hate World 3 in random. I think World 3 is my least favorite world in randomizers, dude. I never know where the hell I'm going half the time. Like, I don't know what the heck I'm doing, man. Macobra might actually just use the cloud right at the start here. No. This would be this would be a pretty decent level to cloud. Grab the block. Throw it into all the Yeah, get wrecked, little boys. Get fucking wrecked. The little nippers, man. The little nippers. All right, level three. This level, I'm scared because like, 
Oh my gosh, I need to go down. Oh my god, the dodges! And I got the leaf, dude. That was... It was all worth it, man. I needed that to be a leaf. If it was a star, I would have to take the elevator of shame. Doing pretty good, Jim Jams. How you doing? Luckily, I clutch it out. And unfortunately, with the way randomizer works, Macobra is going to take the exact same pipe transitions as me. So sadly, um, he's not going to really gain any time here, right? He's going to take the next pipe and take a look. Uh, that's the that I would say that is that can be one of the more frustrating things in randomizer um, Aside from gambles if both opponents don't gamble There's gonna be no no time saving in any world that revolves around pipes because uh, Everyone takes the most logical pipe Which is the closest pipe and you keep checking pipes until you get your answers and that's that's the meta of randomizer So if world 7 is linear nobody's saving any time and everyone's taking all the same pipes so there's really not much you can do about it. Macobra opting to keep his Fire Flower here, which in my opinion is a pretty good idea in Randomizer, especially because you can get the star here. You don't know that you can get the star, but you hope that you can get the star and you want to keep the power up. And I know where the pipe is. I'd already taken it. So I am on my way to the end of this world and it broke the lock. So he's going to check here. Oh, he's going to go for the Hammer Brother first. Fighting Hammer Brothers and Randomizer with Fire Flower is a very good idea because you can pretty much kill them uh, the same amount of time it takes to fight them anyways. And they only take about 7 to 11 seconds. So if he had got a cloud there, uh, I don't think I fought that Hammer Brother. Ooh, and he just realizes. He just finds out about the lock. You hate to see it, don't you guys? You hate to see it. The worst. Yeah, I know I started stream early, guys. I apologize, but I got lots of stuff to do. We got two hours till the point system tournament starts. So I got to get this recording done. And then uh, we'll move on to there. And then uh, we're going to try and get some speed running in later. And then after that, I don't think I have any more uh, point system comms uh, for the next little bit. I think we have two more, pe or two more groups. So four people left. I take a gamble here. I always check the second pipe just to throw my opponent off. And uh, I'd say that was a pretty good uh, gamble because it took me right to this uh, fortress. And in World 7, it's really hard to gamble in World 7. You go in a pipe, and if you see a fortress, just do it. Just do the fortress. So that leaf that I got really helped me in the elevator of shame there. The wild, wacky ride, Rainbow Road there. We got uh, Kaylee yelling at the cats right now. They're probably dicking around doing something. You never know what the heck those guys are doing. I say guys because Eve's Eve's too cute. She's too good of a girl. Like, when it's time to feed the cats, you got Bat and Sim, the two boys, circling you like sharks. Okay? Making noise, meowing. They don't shut the hell up. They just circle you like sharks. You got Eve over by where you put her food dish. She's just sitting there waiting patiently, laying like a loaf. Just waiting, having a good time. I got freaking shark cats. So I think I take the, yeah, I take the pipe and I try and see maybe it's a good idea to just go right back. So we'll check this pipe. That's a good idea. All right, let's see where it takes me. Bad idea. I'm already over there. Um, and I can, I know I have to do one level. Um, so going back to this pipe transition, it, it saves me a level. Rock is the same way Putty's the shark, yeah. Alright, Froxu boys! Let's go! God, I hate this right now, this level, what I'm doing. Come on, something damage me, please. Gonna get the item. I always want to get the item in this level, to be honest. I think it's- Ooh, I almost got shot! And, uh, lucky I kept the P-Speed on that top platform. That's actually pretty tough. Actually pretty tough. Not the easiest thing to do right there. Sometimes you don't have a choice. You can't build it back. All right So I know that some of these pipes have to take me to certain items or islands So I know it's safe to screen transition I take a gamble of checking the furthest pipe because I know my opponent won't check the furthest pipe and it bites me in the ass I feel like I am in the lead. So I felt like I did have time to take a look uh, That's a really good gamble that could have saved me 50 seconds had he checked both of these pipe transitions and the one that I checked was right Big time save. However, it doesn't matter, but I think in my head, I know my opponent's gonna check the pipe that I just went in, so I actually lost time there, unfortunately. 
And it turns out the first fortress that I did actually needed to do that first fortress because it broke the lock in front of the level. So I didn't know that, but seeing it now on Macobra's screen, that's really good. Ooh, he actually, for some reason, I guess he didn't notice the lock there um, because he was just in that pipe. Uh, maybe just a bit of confusion. It's okay. It happens. It happens to all of us. <laughs> Anyone see my game one world three? I don't know what the heck I was doing. God, I hate the level Macobra's in right now. Look at that. Yeah, like almost died there like with no momentum. It's not his fault. I almost die every time I do this level. Uh, lucky for him, he's going to actually save a lot of time on me in this level though. Because I had to wait. He gets the damage boost. Yeah. Alright, look at that. When I saw this world one, I was so happy. Super linear, guys. I just do the fortress in two levels and I'm out. And I know my opponent also has to do that, so he cannot gain the lead with me on gambles. And I feel like I'm in the lead right now. I'm playing very well. I haven't died. There has been no gambles. So, um... At some point in the game, you have to decide, am I in the lead or am I behind? Because if I'm behind, I gotta take some gambles. Or, if you're in the lead, you can take some gambles. I think taking gambles in the lead is a good idea as well. Uh, because it's it can secure your win. Uh, if you're already winning and you make this certain gamble that saves you like a minute and a half, that is that saves you World 8 hassles, man. World 8 can really... Oh my god. I, I don't say I hate World 8, it just... You barely ever get that free, non-confusing World 8. You'd really like to get it. So he does the screen transition as well, and he's good to go. He did not check the pipe that I thought he was going to check. And it probably, it still took him to the island anyways. Dude, this World 7 was kind of free. A couple levels, but pretty free, so. So he did, so everything that I just said about the World 7 pipe with being in the lead and gambling, he did actually save an additional 25 seconds on me from all the pipe transitions. I don't know if it's 25 seconds exactly, but you guys know what I mean. Oh, almost didn't, almost lost 0.5 there with the gamble. Was that a was that a gamble? No, I was forced to do that, bro. So I am actually three levels, three levels and a hammer brother ahead of Macobra right now. Um, I don't think that I'm that far ahead, uh, but I definitely do think I am ahead. There are certain things that you do, like I barely have taken any damage in any levels. I have barely spent any time getting power ups, and I there's been no gambles. So. <laughs> So we're looking pretty good. I got a fat, juicy lead right now. Um, but like I said, I don't know I have a lead. But we, yeah, world eight, man. You never know how this turns out. I've lost the first match, so we don't know. He And he still has his cloud too. I'm wondering if he's gonna do the patented uh, world one uh, cloud strat where he, he's gonna use a music box and cloud, which he doesn't know is going to benefit him a lot uh, because I fought the Hammer Brother and it was a waste, let me tell you. Boy, was it ever a waste. Alright, World 6 equals World 7. Oh, losing 5 points, Macobra, getting the uh, triple triple cards. Alright, good pipe spot. Trolley fire, that's annoying. Alright, here we go. You gotta check. Got a hammer. Why not? All right, why not? Use your items. Do I have another hammer though? I don't. Do I want to do level seven? No. No, I don't. I know there's only one other level on the side. So with pipe transition and death, the next level has to be like 19 seconds long before this is a time loss. So use an item. P-Wing, what level did I get? Ah, eh, this level's pretty quick, so. That was, um, that was actually not a bad idea. That was not a bad idea. That was a pretty good idea. Oh, take damage. Don't get hit again. All right, we're safe. Yeah, see? 
So I did make the right play, but it really needed to be the level that I just did to, to benefit me. And Macobra not actually using the uh, cloud strategies, which to me is a little interesting because there's only one world left. And if he doesn't get a chance to use this cloud, I mean, you might as well just use it somewhere. But each player plays differently, so you never know what's going on inside your opponent's head. Mm -hmm. Getting the off-screen wand grab, look at that. Look at that. Dude, if I could have got that hammer early, man, I would have actually been able to uh, skip a level here. You hate to see it, though. Did not skip a level. And I, I can't actually use my... Oh, I think... I think I can use my hammer to skip a uh, pipe transition. Right? Because World 8, you don't need hammers. So there's no... I don't need these hammers at all. So... I think that's what I do. I think I use it to break the uh, the rock there. I'm not sure, though. My brother moves over. Lock is still there. I'm still gatekeepered right now. Given Macobra such a big chance, because if, if he just uses a hammer and a cloud, does the right fortress... We can see what happens here. He's gonna use a hammer here. I think he has that extra hammer. I think he can actually make that save. He can! Look at that! And music box! Dude, if he would have done the bottom fortress hole, look at that time swing right there. That is incredible! Holy jumping! Oh, so it looks like I opt for the uh, kill. P-Wing's not too bad. I was hoping for a cloud. We're near the end of the game, and again, like I said, I feel like I have a lead, so if I got a cloud there, and my opponent did as well, he would not be able to gain that lead on me. Kind of what I was trying for. Going for the damage boost strats. I got a P-Wing. I can afford it. Take the damage. Uh, but luckily, Macover also did the wrong fort. And we got the MFP tunnel. Oh yeah, 0.5 points added to my total. Let's freaking go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see some MFP tunnels in chat, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see some MFP tunnels. Let's go! We nailed it. Alright, I opt to do the bottom level. I'm a little annoyed here because I was thinking to myself, uh, if I get freaking... Uh, I'm so annoyed here. Uses a music box but does the coin ship. I'm not sure about that. All right, so I say screw it. So now having to do this level, I'm like, nah, I lost. I feel like I'm losing my lead right now. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking right now. I'm like, just get this level over with, please. Got Cheap Cheap going so slow. What was he doing? Do you see how slow that Cheap Cheap was going? However, I do this level a little bit faster than my opponent, luckily, and getting the tunnel. All right, I'm out of there. I'm done with this world. Moving on to world eight. And of course, ooh, don't fall and I fall, what? And I died, dude. Yes, why don't you spend more time in your inventory, Mitch? Look at this. His world six, he saved like a minute and a half, two minutes on me. Because the hammer usage. And I died because I stink. The star music right now only expresses exactly what I'm going for. Felt good to take damage right there. Felt real good. Holy crap, man. All right, since we're on the same airship, let's go. Let's go, World 8. You love to see a fortress right at the start. If you see a fortress right at the start, you know, okay, locks, locks are in motion, things are going good. I think I have a one, two, three. I have a three and a half second lead on Macobra right now. This is intense. You, you, ladies and gentlemen at home on YouTube, you don't know who wins and loses, so this is crazy. Alright, check the first pipe. 
What is it? No way. I'm not crossing there. What the hell is that? Oh, I get the hand level. Oh, he kills himself. What the heck? All right, I know I'm safe. Get me past this stupid hand level. Cobra having a little trouble here. Ooh, takes the death. That's actually going to really help me here. Okay. All right, he decides to use the suit. What does he do next? No elevator. Sh no no sand, sand shaft of shame. That's pretty good. Ooh, right on. Thank you. Fuck yeah, they're hot. Thanks, babe. Mmm. <laughs> Got some french fries. Let's go. What? I looked over. I thought he was dead. <laughs> so I'm like, ah, oh, please one cycle. I damage boost because I was like, I'm not one. I'm not not one cycling. Very important. So McCobra takes the pipe. I'm not sure where it leads. It leads right to the end, but he's missing a bridge. That means the first fortress we did actually opened up the bridge. All right, look at that. So I saw that that did not break that lock and that made me very happy because I can get the heck out of the hand bridge area. No cloud for this level. This level is a piece of garbage. I hate this level so much. Do I try and do it the fast way? I died too. I can't believe we both died on that level. Get 8-2 out of the roll. Get it out of the roll. Get it out of the game. I'm taking damage. Taking damage. I'm scared right now. If I... Oh my gosh. So we don't know where to go. So Macobra breaks that lock and we know that we don't need to break that lock. Because I already went the other direction. So I beat this level. And we know one bridge is broken. Is the second bridge broken though? That's the question. If it's not for me, then I'm going to have to go back and find somewhere else to go. I'm going to have to go left in the pipe and find where to go. Go in these pipe. I'd have to go back to the dark section if these if the two bridges aren't, aren't open. Oh, snap. The two bridges are open. Activate hammer suit. Let's go. McCobra not getting the one cycle, but it's okay. He opted for small Mari. He has a power up. So he has a very strong feeling that he's in the right fortress. Dude, I actually almost took damage there. So he's not even going to check the other pipe. He's just going to go straight for this pipe. See if the bridges are open. He's got a couple pipe transitions to make. I got some clips. I get the clip first try. So you know it's over. You know it's over from here. You know it's over. Oh snap, how are we doing? We're doing pretty good. How are you doing? And I killed Bowser. I won race two. Let's go. Right on. All right. Luckily, this is randomizer. So I'm actually just going to... I'm going to stop this for a quick sec. I'm going to switch over screens. What a win by Mitch. I'm going to switch over screens. Start the Mario 3 music again. There we go. I'm going to bring it back. We're going to fast forward here. To the next match. Let's go! I officially won game two. Yo, save the Ted. Thank you for the 1,000 bits, man. I really appreciate that. YouTube, you better appreciate it too, YouTube. All right, let's go here. What's going on? All right. I'm actually gonna eat my. Uh, I'm gonna eat my food while you guys watch this race. So I'm just gonna go ahead and mute and close my subs so you guys don't have to watch me eat. I'm gonna go really fast.
Stop with the pausing! <clears throat> Look at it! We're synced! Leave it alone! Yeah, it was probably Twitch. It's always Twitch.
I'll be back soon, guys. I promise. I'm almost done. Almost done. Hey, Zero Wolf, enough of that guff. I see you there. All right. All right, I'm back. <clears throat> what up, guys? I am back. All right, so what did I miss? Looks like we're doing a gamble here in World 6. I noticed that I took a strong lead in World 7 there while I was eating. Um, and it seems like in World 6 now that one pipe took us right to the end. Yeah, sorry, guys. I took my plate into the kitchen there, and then the cats freaking sharked me. They just fucking hovered me. I got my it's a good thing I jumped because that star did not stay all the way till the end. So I'm guessing Macobra's working his way. I guess he's gonna enter world six now. Okay. I see that other I see the other fortress over there. 
Uh, I am gonna have to wait for an inventory to open up. Yeah, I made a good gamble on the Fortress in World 7. I remember that, too. I'm still not getting right gambles here, man. This is crazy. This World 6. Oh, my gosh. Macobra with that save. Absolutely incredible. I knew I wouldn't die there. I knew I wouldn't die there with that jump. That's like a little strategy that I know in this level that you, you don't die if you just hug the wall. Getting lucky. You like the transparent hat? It's just green. Dude, it drives YouTube crazy. People go crazy. There you go. So I know I got to do this stupid fortress. It's always every time you make the wrong gamble, the right fortress you need always ends up being this fortress. So judging just based on my movement, I can tell that I think I'm behind right now. Um, because I was way too worried about taking damage there and having to wrap around and go, go back and grab another power up. I knew I wasn't going to make it. It kind of looked like I could have made it, but I don't know. I didn't risk it. So I'm I'm a little annoyed right now because of how close I am. And Makobra hasn't done the screen transition. So he looks like he's, he's doing the same amount of fortresses that I am because we know the fortress that he's doing is not going to make the bridge to the end. Unfortunately. Oh, yeah. He... Had, he he had the star. He could have kept going. You just ate dinner? Me too. All right, you babies. You can come inside, but no dicking around. Come on. You should have saw the way... You should have saw the way he just looked at me. He's like, no way. I can come in? Are you serious? He, like, looked around. Dude, I just got wrecked. I just got a ball in the face, guys. I just got a ball in the face. All right, Makova realizing he's got to do this extra level. What? There's nothing in here, bud. All of them in here right now. All of them just surrounding me. There's just three cats. What? Ah. I don't think so. Yeah. You smelt it, but you can't see it. Oh, looks like Twitch is acting up again a little bit. All right, so Macobra entering. I'm entering World 3. I, do, I don't think I have Double Hammer anyways. It doesn't look like it would help me all that much. Oh, it would. Double Hammer would definitely have helped. Which one is the cutest one? Uh, Bat. I don't, I don't know. Bat's really cute. Sim is super handsome, and Eve is just extremely uh, passive. So like, they're all they're all amazing in their own way. But Sim is also passive as well. It's really hard to tell. Macobra, luckily he was small. He could just run right through. But I think he didn't get the one cycle though. So. I like seeing World 3s like this because I know that I'm not going to get screwed over with gambles. Right, get me the heck out of this level. I hate this level in Rando. You never know what the heck's going to happen. Nice. So, Macobra making it out. So, in reality, Macobra still has his cloud. Um, have I used my cloud yet? The cuddliest. Oh, the cuddliest is uh, bad. Go on, go on. Bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Oh, here it is. What the heck? He kicked me with his foot, man. He freaking kicked me with his foot. Mitch always wins. Well, I didn't win there. I just lost hard. But we get to see something we barely ever see in Rando. Oh, and then I got Chungus super hard there. Did a dope ass belly belly shell hit. 
Oh, yeah. All right, so Macobra, he's got no choice but to take the same pipe as me. So he's not going to be able to save really any time, but I did die. Uh, I don't know if I have the cloud. Dude, that was a close death right there. I already got foot in the face and stun locked. So, it would seem fitting that the next thing would have been... A freaking boss bass. You got a nice bass. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, uh -huh. You got a nice bass bass. <laughs> Get out of here, you stupid fire bro. They don't work when they're on platforms. Freaking Ha is guilty of that too. He put it in Rift Bros. All right, so one of these pipes leads somewhere. I know that I don't need, because the lock did not break. So I know that there's one fortress, so I can probably get out of this world. Oh, this is my favorite level right here. This is the first Mario Maker level, 1988, right here. Did you know? Mm-hmm. Getting gulped. I think that was intentional, though. Yeah, he's gonna cloud here. Nice. He's gonna take the pipe so he knows it's safe. There's two forts. There's two locks. Don't need to do either fort. I'm out of there. All right. Here we go. McCobra could have actually saved a lot of time there if he did the 7-7 clip, but that's not like a thing that you really do. You know, you don't... Nobody does it. Right? Yeah, this is when the audio glitch happened. Dude, that was crazy, man. That you, The end credits were... I don't even think the end credits are randomized in the game. So what happened is that in... In the vanilla version of Mario 3, if you grab that star on a very specific frame, you can you can eliminate this star music and it plays the level music. Well, I think in the code that because it's randomized, whenever it switched to the level music, it just assigned to like the end credits. It's crazy. Crazy. Alright, I'm happy to see no gambles in World 4. No gambles in World 4. Yep, I'm out of here, World 4, you piece of garbage. However, I have not seen a fortress yet. We don't know where a fortress is. I always pick the wrong levels, guys. Always. So that was an intentional death there because I do not want to do this level. Even speedrunning 4-3, it takes a long time. This level is much faster. I tried to do the double block grab, but I failed miserably, guys. I failed. The Cobra's got the coin ship now. Trying to catch up to me. He's he's pretty close. He's right here, right? I'm just a level ahead. That's it. Both getting the hammers. Dude, I love seeing the hammer item. Alright, I think I have a music box. No, I don't, but I got a star. Star me, baby. I used the star to get a star. This is stupid. Macobra trying to clutch those strats. I said, oh man, I, I sat there, I was like, uh, this could be such an incredible gamble, but either way, I could do both forts in a row. So I did waste time trying to figure it out. My brain was like, Mitch, you gotta figure it out, bro. You're all over the place. 
Definitely want that power up. I feel like I should have act- well, no. I was gonna say, I feel like I should have activated the Thwomp, but... Cobra's not even checking. He's just gonna take the pipe, so he definitely saved some time there. He's just gonna do the fortress. Holy crap. That's it. And then... Oh! So I had an opportunity to do a very scary, bad, risky gamble, but... No one in the right mind... Well, I mean, Macobra did it in the first race, but still, he, he's not right mind, I guess. Because, like, why would I do a level and then the fortress, and if it's wrong, I gotta go back and do the pipe because it didn't break the law? Uh, it's just a nightmare. Especially getting the hammer, because it was, like, enticing, right? So Macobra's right on the airship. He's right behind me, man. Nice. Destroyed that weird yellow block thing. Don't know what that was about, but <clears throat> it was definitely there. You want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. God, I hate the World 4 boss in this game. So cheap. Oh, we got a cloud item. Nope, not taking the gamble. There's a fortress in my path anyways. Why would I take it, right? Odds are we're not even going to be able to use the, uh, the hammer in this world anyways. So we'll see how it goes. Oh, the sun has turned into some weird thing. I don't think McCover's going to go for that. Yeah, he's not going to go for it. He has these preemptive decisions made way before me. Like, I entered World 2 and I was like, mm, okay, so Fortress there, mm, 3 minus 2, um, okay, let me take that, and, um, okay, I should do this level first. <clears throat> Alright. Normally the tail in this level is worse, but I was actually doing some pretty good work uh, during the finals with the tail in this level. So I, we're on the same level, so he's definitely caught up. He's definitely caught up. Save some time, World 4. We're going to see what happens here. Always boss fast in this level, right? He's always there. It's weird. It's like he gets this tile set more than others. Oh, are we going to go for the swag? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wee! We got it. No 293, though. We did it. McCover finishing up the airship as well, though. Nothing really fun to see in the airship. It's just kind of jank, jank, and more jank. Use that star. I was like, come on, man, be a cloud. And, like, I get an early cloud. And it was a cloud. Epic cloud right there. Pure RNG, because if that hammer brother isn't there for McCobra. <gasps> combo! Woo! Dude, I love the combos in this game. Use your items, man. Use your items. Not only does using your items, it's good because it's in the now, but when you don't use your items, your inventory gets all clogged and, and full. Ah, oh, he skipped the hammer, brother. That's it right there. That's the cloud, man. But he did the same move as me. Yeah, combo it. Get out of there. Yeah, man. Use the items, dude. Good, Great combos right there. Oh! Gets the off-screen wand grab. We might be able to fast forward five seconds here. Oh yeah, it looks like it. He's gonna get the boss. Get the fast forward five seconds, maybe five more. Right into world eight, let's go. Dude, pro fast forward is right there. Five seconds apiece. First fortress in the first section of world eight. You love to see it. Ah, oh, I should have went for that star. Yep, I got the off screen wand grab, that's right. Right on. All of our races so far have been really close. He's opting to go into the pipe first. He would be in the lead right now. Depending. We're not sure. And then he doesn't do that fortress. Very interesting. I, w I wonder if he's just, you know, checking for science, kind of. 
Ooh, stuck behind the thing there. So I think he's gonna do the fortress? Yeah, okay. That lock. This pipe. Don't know what's going on right now. <sighs> gotta do the fortress, guys. I gotta do it, man. As soon as you see a fortress, man, you gotta do it. I, we have no idea, or at least I have no clue where the heck to go, right? Not on Link Bomb Chew. Yo, thanks a lot, man. Um, there's another match tonight with two fantastic runners. We got Makobra tonight versus Zikubi. That's going to be incredible. All right, so I saw that fortress not break the lock, so I'm kind of happy. Kind of happy about that. And I saw the fortress break that lock. Now I'm going down that pipe. Makobra also making work. And I'm mad. I did an extra fortress, man. That's so lame. That's so lame. The extra fortress. Alright. I know I'm clean, though. I'm getting all the fortresses out of the way. But that's not gonna be what you need. You don't... It's not about all the fortresses. It's about the right fortresses. was this scratch all right and it didn't break that lock so i know i'm i know i don't have to do any more fortresses i'm clean i'm good to go i don't have to do any fortresses at all Ooh, two bridges where do i go no that's not right don't go there The fortress right there. I don't need to do it though, Cloud. That's so risky. Incredible. And I made it. And I didn't get pulled in by a hand. Oh my goodness, dude. And I did an extra fortress, man. Lucky that cloud. Well, the cloud didn't save me because. That's right, Macobra was a couple fortresses away. So what happened was is I did the fortresses before I found where to go. He found where to go before he did all the fortresses that he needed, so... It happens. Oh! First try clip again! You love to see it. Yeah, we, we haven't got an easy World 8 yet. They're always so stressful in these runs. Alright. So, it looks like I'm taking game two. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Oh, so he broke that lock. So, we, that was a waste. Wee. He knows. Yo, save the 10 with the 5 gift subs. Thanks, man. You are on the top of the leaderboard. Top of the leaderboard, my dude. It looks like I missed one for Memer Dan as well. Thank you, Memer Dan. You guys put my kids through college. I don't even have kids yet. <laughs> Thank you very much, guys. I do appreciate it. All right, we're going to go ahead and fast forward to the next race. I had won match number two. Let's go. Come on. I just need to win one more. And I got this. I take it home, guys. Ugh, go away, fan. I'm cold. I don't have time for your freaking gusty winds. Yo, Series Lover with the gift sub. Thank you. We are on match four right now. That is correct. I need to win this match, but I need to win this third match. It's the fourth match, but it'll be my third win. Just to be on the leaderboard for a moment. Don't worry, you'll be up there for long. Alright, World 6 is the start. Cobra opting to get the Hammer Brother first. I want to take the pipe. 
Takes me right to the end. I'm kind of doing a little bit of a gamble here. Macobra is so weird what he did there. He didn't even check the pipe first. He just went straight for the fortress. So what will it be, Captain? Which fort? We don't know yet. Oh my gosh, Macobra! Hanging on for dear life, dude. Hanging on for dear life. He wants that power up, I think. Yeah, he does. Oh, Star is fantastic. Alright, so let's go ahead and see. Alright. I got a marathon here. Ooh, the bridge is out! From True Lies. The bridge is out. There is a point system race tonight, yes. He's gonna go ahead and do the same fortress. Oh my goodness! If he would have used the P Wing, holy crap, but instead he. Oh. He should have known too because this was 7 Fort, right? The These two levels are always with each other, right? Aren't they? Oh, he goes for the death and does use the P Wing. Okay. That, that had to have been faster, but it, he doesn't really get the full optimization of the level, unfortunately, of the P Wing strats. That stupid ghost. And then I got RNG Hotfoot going on right now. Alright, let's go. Alright, we made it. All we know is that he's on the right track. So I double checked to make sure the lock was there. I'm good. Using that peeling. Oh my god, Macobra getting the off screen wand grab. Absolutely incredible. Oh, dude, I thought I was going to take damage up at the top there because of the little sprites, the little sprite explosions. Yeah, Mitch, keep rubbing on every freaking wall there, buddy. Oh, do we get two off screen wand grabs? Looks like it. Oh, we can get one fast forward, I think. Yeah, there we go. World 7 music. Oh, Macobra. He's opted to do the first pipe. I wonder where that's going to take him. You guys, you guys know me. I always do my, my silly second pipe strat. Oh yeah, second pipe. Let's go. And where did it take me? Right there, dude. I saved the pipe transition. So we are in the same level. Alright, Macobra, a big form of relief there to know that he got the right fortress. So that means I also did the right fortress too, so I'm pretty happy to see it. I do lose time there trying to get the uh, the question orb on the top of that block. That would save a little bit of time. So believe it or not, guys, I actually think I'm ahead right now because of uh, this World 7. Because I checked the second pipe and it took me right here. Um, so I was thinking to myself, okay, the first pipe probably didn't take him to this section and he might be flip-flopping around, but that is not true as you can see. I am not ahead, but I think I'm ahead. I remember, ex I remember specifically thinking I was ahead here. Very tight race. Oh, we can get a little fast forward going, can't we? 
All right, what world is it now? It is world four. And it looks like it started with the two pipes. It did, definitely did. So bottom pipe is the way to go. Think about how much time I save if I just went straight to the bottom pipe. So, oh my goodness, Macobra, he's all over the place. He can't make it up. Jump. Jump, my friend, jump. Okay, so I took a huge gamble here by just going straight to this fortress without even looking. And because I already think that I'm ahead, you can see that this fortress builds the bridge. And I don't know, I didn't think that Macobra would have done this path, but he definitely did. So I put the hand I put the HBs to sleep. I thought about it. No, nope, gonna die. And my brothers are still asleep for me. So I actually kinda took the lead here. Oh yeah. Yeah, except that happened to me. Oh, just lost the lead. Look at us, we're synced. Holy crap! Oh boy, oh boy, man. Scary stuff. We're right on- we're, we're right on pace though. Look at this. Unfortunately, I have to fight the Hammer Brother, though, and it gives me a star. Boo! Uh, looks like he had an anchor. I did not have an anchor. I don't even have an item. And I gotta fight the World 4 boss, so I'm very scared right now. I'm like, please be an item, please be an item. If that was a star, I probably would have died. I probably would have died. But I'm trying to make sure I hit the boss while it's still in the air. That way, I won't go through the boss if that happens. I won't, like, morph through it, so. Oop. Get a fast forward going. All right, here we go. All right, world one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh! One try, two tries, three tries, four tries. Five tries, one try for me! <laughs> you love to see it. So that first try, again, I, I think I'm in the lead and now I'm actually in the lead. Before I was not in the lead. Well, you had it easier, thanks. Didn't know that. <laughs> it's not like I'm bragging or anything, it's just it's cool to see it. Unfortunately, I took damage there, so I'm gonna have to actually go back in and then go back in. Uh, taking that damage there is such a big issue. It's such a huge thing. He was able to catch up such a large amount there. Now we're back on pace again. I did a turn back. Oh, I made it. I wasn't gonna have any flubbing from last time. I think he damage boosts too. No, he doesn't. <sighs> I did not get the one cycle. That was a big time catch up for me as well. Oh, for swag strats here. I wouldn't risk it, man. I just go through. There's no, uh. It's too scary for me. All right, got my fire flower back. I am happy. Oh my gosh, stuff falling from the ceiling all over the place. I do not lose 0.5 there though. Take a little sip of my drinky drink.
That's so weird. You think this would be the first, the world one fortress, right? Because of the, or no, the first fortress would be the world one fortress, but it wasn't. What fortress was it? Yo, thank you, Ewitty. Dude, the drunk hot feet, man. See, look at that. It's so trolly, man. God, I hate the little hot feet. They're so annoying. Did I lose my... I Okay, so I have my fire flower as well. So that makes me very happy because... Having a fire flower on the coin ship is like very easy to fight the, the little boomerangs. Watch, you just do a left-right shoot and you're pretty good. <laughs> Done. See you later, buds. Quick grab. Music box, FTW, let's go. Flip into the wall, pog it. Oh my gosh, my air, my World 7 airships are so bad. It's a good thing I, like, I could practice rando. There are a lot of levels in randomizer that I could do that no matter what the enemy sets are, you can still do it really fast. It was a two hitter, so I kind of wasted time trying to fire kill him. Well, I mean, if I nailed that last shot, that would have been really good, but. Oh, we're both on the airship. Let's go. All right. Airships are the only things we can really skip because they're lame. So right now, in my mind, it's like, please, man, just give me a Fast World 3, dude. Just give me a Fast World 3, please. A Fast World 3. All right. Fight this Hammer Brother. Taking a gamble here, getting one Hammer Brother out of the way. Ooh, a Hammer. Hammers are really good. Hammers are really good. All right. Check this pipe. Where you, where you going, stranger? All right. So we found the way to go. What are we going to do? Are we going to do the level or are we going to do the fortresses? And they're both right there, so might as well do the fortress. What? That fish right there? Also, door three? I don't think so. I don't think so. Not randomizer. Is he going to duck jump? He didn't, but he still got... Oh! He almost died there. Oh, and the... Dude, so close, man. So much crap. Why did I go... I did an extra input to the right. I don't know why I did that. So I'm checking to see... Did it break the lock? Nope. It is the first one. You hate to see it. <gasps> so I'm ahead by one fortress, but also ahead by a little bit of knowledge. Knowledge that he's going to find out very shortly. He's going to find out very, very shortly which one the pipe. So it's not a huge advantage. If he somehow does both fortresses, I'm going to be like, what the heck? There we go. So he's in the right pipe. He's going to have some information here. Damn. But he knows the lock is right. The, the fortress is right there. So it's pretty good. It's not too bad. He's got it. Alright, meanwhile, I'm finishing up the fort. We're already on- we're going to the sixth world already, and it's 16 minutes in. This is like such a fast seed. McCobra's saving time here in this fortress because he got the star. Big time save. I'm gonna go for these power-ups here. I'm gonna find out that this is a leaf, though, not what he was looking for. Come on, Wendy, get the heck out of here. <gasps> da -dun -dun. Da -dun -dun. Yo, Dukin, what's going on? Watching the playback here, doing a little commentary. Everything's looking great. All right, we can do a little fast forward. Maybe one more. World 2 right away, and there's a pipe right there in World 2. You'll love to see it. Oh, so you know instantly it doesn't matter as long as I do a fortress. As long as I do that fortress right there, it's going to open up either path. 
the beauties of world 2 i love world 2 and randomizer because almost every scenario results in you like it's, it it's almost always do one fortress oh my gosh i'm bouncing on a billion enemies this guys all over the place you guys remember yesterday in the points race when uh, I think Zero Planes got locked out by the stupid bullet bills? He couldn't finish 8 1 fast enough. So silly. Alright. Yep. So here in my mind, I if I don't break the lock, that is a very bad idea. So I should not get the item. If I get the item, no lock will break, which means I have to go back and do the other fortress. Which means I will be a sad Mitch Flower Power. And I'm kind of sad already because I would have liked to see what item it was. So for anyone who doesn't know, the anchors are wild cards. The anchors can are randomized items. But not all the time. When you use an anchor on one seed and it gives you a fire flower, the anchor will always be a fire flower on that seed. It all depends. Ooh, baby! using the stars those are great for the hammer brothers gonna kill the boomerangs and what item do we get it's a cloud of course it's a cloud world 2 like always has a cloud use them use them if you got them guys we only got one world left use them if you got them cloud it baby Ooh, a two-hitter. So it looks like Macobra is also going to get that cloud. I don't know if he feels like he's behind or ahead yet. I can't tell, but I feel like I am ahead. And I'm definitely ahead. But I feel like I'm ahead by a lot more than I actually am. I'm not ahead by this much. Ooh, we're never going to see what that level was. We'll never see what that level is. Very unfortunate. <laughs> All right, so I'm you I have a lot of music boxes here, so I'm using them in world five I've already decided I don't need any more items. This is world five the hammers are useless uh, None of them are probably clouds, so I'm gonna try and avoid getting movements of like four and stuff here It was Atlantis and Fort Knox and three six what? Fort Knox was in was in the very first world in this world in this in this run. Fort Knox was the second fortress in this world. All right, so we got the airship for the fortress in this world, and now Macobra's got to do what I just pretty much did. Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh, cause the shitty levels. Okay, yeah, no, now okay. Yeah, we are currently uh, 2864. 2864. Yeah, don't listen to the bot. Oh, wait, no, we're 2749. Never mind, I take it back. <laughs> All right, listen to the bot. Yeah, 2749 is what we are at. All right, the pipe takes us right to the end, and I used the perfect amount of music boxes. So thank God. How did it drop so fast from 3K? Well, I mean, when you get gift subs last month, the gift subs run out, right? When you enter the next month, that's it's normal. That's what normally happens. I don't have I don't have 3,000 genuine tier one subs that are resubscribing every single month, right? I have I have a lot of genuine subs, but I also have a lot of gift subs as well. So I have a huge lead right now. I'm on the airship. Um, Macobra only really has one extra level, but he's still got a whole bunch of uh, movements with the Hammer Brothers. Not using the uh, music boxes. I, pro I probably saved a, a total of four or five seconds just using those music boxes from all from all the stupid movements of. Get off me, bud! Oh my god, that was so scary.
Cobra glitching through the platform. Very unfortunate for him. I don't want you up with this glitch. Alright, World 8. Come on, buddy. Be nice to me. Let's go. Fortress right away at the start. Love to see it. Who's winning? Uh, I got two wins right now. McCobra has one. It's best out of five. And I am in the lead and in World 8 right now. Let's go. Doing swag-ass tail swipes. <laughs> All right, we're taking one pipe. Pipe transitions, let's go. Taking me there. Don't do another pipe. Come on, World 8. Not good enough for me, man. I want to take another pipe. The whole lock and everything is way too close for me. So we'll take this other pipe. Alright, we'll take this pipe. There's a lock there. I don't know where the heck I'm going right now. Entered the hand level. It ended up being a hand level anyways. Uh, I ended up doing this level because it's really short. I might as well get it done. Oh my gosh. So I'm, I'm losing my lead right now because of these pipes. I got confused and I took that pipe. I don't know what the heck I'm doing, man. World 8 is so trolly. Got this pipe. Oh my gosh. Dude, World 8s are so trolly, man. World dates are the worst. One year. One year pog, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Saw fire flower. I think it's a really good idea to get this fire flower. Yo, welcome back for one year. Thank you very much. Cobra go for that fortress. It doesn't make any sense. He was right there. God, this is the most awkward world aid ever. So we're gonna check this pipe. Right? He went to this fortress, but not the other, which makes no sense. That fortress was further away, and he didn't know which fortress was which. That's such a random gamble. That's like... It makes he was right beside the other fortress and said no, but then said yes to the fortress that was further away, and there was no way to tell which one was which. It makes no sense. But hey man, it's all about the gambles, right? So I found the way to Bowser's and I beat the fortress. Doesn't open the bridge though. Does not open the bridge. Yeah, but a risk would have been doing the fortress that would, would have been close to you. I mean, you're, you were already there, right? He lost time doing the pipe transition, so... It was definitely a gamble, but it happens. So I'm doing my next fortress here. Yeah, you were just as confused. Yeah, pretty much, man. It's freaking ridiculous. You could say the same thing about what I'm doing. Like, why the heck am I doing, like... All this crap like I like doing all, I at least like doing all the fortresses that aren't friggin oh my god the bridge still isn't broken there's only one fortress left and Macobra's done it Macobra has done the fortress he's already done it
Unbelievable. Unfrickin' believable. <laughs> so lucky, dude. So incredible. Like, that's like a four minute luck swing right there. No, he, there's no way he could have known which one it was because I was never in the lead because I didn't do it. I didn't find Bowser's until very far into it anyways. There's no way. There's no way anyone knew. Nobody cheats. It's randomizer. There's nothing to cheat. Oh. Well. Everyone on YouTube right now who's sitting there thinking. Awesome. There we go. Unless he somehow takes damage or dies right here, I I've lost this race. Fucking world eight, man. So trolly, dude. Right right now I see Macobra's text is red. I see his text is red on speedruns.com. Or speedruns live. There it is. And I lost, and I'm thinking to myself, how the hell did I lose that match? I was, we got to World 8 at 23 minutes. World 8 took me so long, over seven minutes. All right, well, good news is, is we have a point system tournament match coming up in 25 minutes. So guess what, YouTube? You got the first four matches. Me and Macobra are tied two to two. You're gonna have to wait another day or two for the final match to see who wins the randomizer tournament get you baited youtube have a good time see you guys later i hope you enjoyed take it easy don't forget to subscribe obviously <laughs>